Good work, Witcher. A few people died, but I'll turn a blind eye. Self-defense. Well done. The community is better without their kind. Back to business. Gellert's the one responsible. Great. I will secure the evidence and the drugs. <laughs> Excellent plan. Perhaps I should kill everyone involved in trafficking Fistek. Or maybe I inform... What roils you? You got all you want. That's the only reason I'm still talking to you. But don't give me any more orders. As a bet... Fistek softens your brain. Get ready, Carol. Don't worry about me. There are more massacres in the non-human quarter. As Valkonex says, the only good out. What a day.
What? I killed them. Strange. Admitting to a guard you digest. <laughs> You've done well. <laughs> Maybe you should disappear. Me? I don't get it. Deal Fistek again, and I'll make sure you're never found. Okay, don't worry. I'm a law enforcement officer. Farewell, Jethro. Geralt, I was looking for you. I had no idea Nurse Natala was such a wellspring of passion. You ever seen her leaning over patients? <laughs> Dandelion. In any case, I was on my way here to entertain Natala with some scintillating conversation when I passed these two odd-looking men dragging out this kid who was hollering and crying. They called him by his name. I think it was Alpin or Albin or something. Shit, that's who I'm here for. Well, you'll be proud of me. Oblivious to any danger, I decided to help the kid and followed them. They dragged him to this house. You're right. I am impressed. Told you. You have to take me with you this time. This is true ballad material. Matter of fact, I'll lead you there. The house is in the non-human district. Follow me. Quick, Geralt. There's no time to lose. Quick, Geralt. There's no time to lose. Quick, Geralt. There's no time to lose. I served under Barbary Owls. In the free company. A Brenner. A fight to remember. This is where they brought out. Great. Wait here and don't enter until the fighting starts. You always tell me to wait outside. No. This time I'm going in with you. I'll create a new genre. The proactive ba- I don't want you around when I start- Okay. I guess poetry requires- Geralt, hurry! I'm glad you're here. Everything will be all right. Are they dead? Yes, Alvin. They gave me no choice. I understand, Geralt. Take me away from here. Whoa, that's a lot of blood. Geralt. And here's the boy. See? Where would you be without me? Shh. They're coming. Grab the kid and go out back. You heard them outside? Amazing. Take him to Triss. She's a sorceress. She'll protect him best. Oof. Doubt that'll make Shani happy. But it's better than angering a sorceress, I guess. Get going. Okay. I'll leave the boy with Triss. You dare challenge the Salamandra!
Shani, a- I know. Dandelion told me. Why is the boy still with Triss? I'll tell you once I've spoken with her. All right, I'll wait. Do what you must. No, Alvin. Swords are not toys. You'll understand when you're older. But I want to learn how to fight. Geralt. Triss, about... Mm-hmm. Is he safe? Yes. Dandelion brought him here and explained. I knew I could count on you. Is Shawnee clear about this? No? Then go tell her the- I... Well, if I have to. Though I'd rather face a swarm of ghouls. Geralt. Listen, about- Progress already? I decided to help Yavin and the Scoyatel against the Order of the Flaming Rose. Interesting. Why did you decide to help the non-humans? I understand the non-humans' ideals and agree with them to an extent. The elves and dwarves are fighting for freedom and dignity, causes that deserve to be aided. How noble of you. And what of the famous Witcher's neutrality? You're drowning in your sense of decency, though it always gets you in trouble. If you could only remember how many times you've been driven by your heart, what you believed was right, you wouldn't be surprised by your choice. Do you think I've chosen as I would have before I lost my memory? I do. And that Geralt I like. 